Right, first piece of equipment. Double ended training lead. Okay. Attached to a check chain that is properly sized for the dog, measured to fit, and obviously correctly fitted. All dogs are worked on the left, so this is how the check chain should be, and the dog will be on your left when working. Okay, the idea of this equipment is that everything hangs loose and the dog comes with you. Alright, it's not the idea of the dog to hang itself on the check chain and struggle and pull you around. Okay, and there you go. Nice loose lead walking, check chain hangs loose, as you can see, fully extended. Okay, so none of this rubbish you hear from all these fools. The idea of a check chain is simple, it is there to hang loose and open, unlike any other collar that you're wrapping around a bull terrier's neck and tightening up to fit the conformation of the skull so it doesn't slip off. There are only two types of collars to use on a bull terrier, be it miniature or standard. This is one of them. Alright? Only those who do not know the breed and do not know how to handle the breed are the ones who scream loudly about the use of them. And they are correct if people using them are not trained in the use of them. Yes, then they are dangerous. Okay? Right, so you can see we're just walking around, it's all been loose lead. Right, I'm going to swap equipment over and show you another set of equipment for working. 